Yo, what's good? What's going on? What's up, everybody? What's up? What's up? Yo, welcome to the stream. How goes it? How goes it? How everybody doing this evening? You know we ain't gonna let the whole ticker go down. We gonna jump right into it. Uh-oh, let me make sure. Y'all let me know if everything good. Got to make sure saying my bit rate is low. Let me make sure this thing's still going properly. Make sure it's still streaming properly. All right, YouTube. Yeah, what's going on? What's going on? Hope everybody's doing well. Shout out to you and yours. Look, we're going to keep rocking until I see something different. Y'all hear me all right? Let me, let me do the little quick intro. What's up, everybody? Charles Macro jumping back in the fishing planet. We here on the stream. It's a holiday Halloween promo time, and it's the curse of the Frankenfish back again uh, another year. So we about to jump into this and approach it. So if you're here with me right now, if you get in, when you get here as y'all come in, man, first of all, hit that like button, subscribe, do all that good stuff, follow. Also, I'm going to need y'all's help because I've never – done this before i didn't do this last year so i'm jumping in fresh learning it while we doing it as i go all right so if any of y'all are familiar with it or if you've done it before again we're gonna we're gonna do it together I'm trying to get this hair out of my way all right all right so what's up let me see who in here first before we get going what's up brandon what's up amanda oh what's up warrior carter what up Jacob, what's good? What's good? Yeah, hope everybody doing well, man. Appreciate y'all being here this evening. Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to let it down. I had to take it out. I usually have it in the little braids or whatever, so I had to go on and take it out, get something done to it tomorrow, get myself looking like somebody. <laughs> Sleep, what's good? Sleep, what's going on? What's going on? How goes it? Sleep is here in the building. Um, I got, I'm here at Blue Crab right now, but we're going to start at Lone Star. I'm here at Blue Crab. I got a little bit in here. I always come here to grind, make some money. Last two days, I ain't got to fish much, guys. I ain't get to do a lot of fishing. I fished some yesterday, just a little bit today, but it's been busy. Yesterday was real busy work. Today's busy. I still got some stuff to do, some videos to edit and stuff like that. So, you know, I ain't get to get in and do the grinding I usually do daily, but that's all right. So from what I know about this, you guys, again, I'm going to need y'all help. Y'all help me out. We're going to do this together with this Halloween promo. Um, from what I know, you got the Frankenfish, but that's one of the last things you're going to do. You got to get the book, the scary kayaking thing. I don't know if we're going to do this race. Uh, scary kayaking and the Emerald. From what I know, you're supposed to do this scary kayaking first, I guess. So I was going to go to Lone Star, and I think you got to get different fish from different places to use. But um, I'm going to start with this scary kayaking. If y'all know anything else that I should do, let me know. If I need to start somewhere else, uh, bring the candle in, wait until dark, interact with the scarecrow, complete the terrifying pumpkin race. So is this the first thing we should do, the pumpkin race? Or go to Quanchkin and go after this? I, I'm not sure what you do. I saw you need bait coins for stuff, but you get bait coins for the fish. Again, I'm learning this kind of as I go to see what you get and what you're actually rewarded with guys so i'm gonna leave here we're gonna go to the main map and we'll get started there let's see let's see struggling with the ghost pike okay that stinks look hopefully we won't we'll be able to catch them uh you did the crock pot ribs you recommended they was elite hey that's what's up that's what's up warrior yeah you know we're gonna do us some segments man when we really get on the uh the culinary arts, you know, the cooking and such. Warrior did the crock pot ribs, man. I'll try to tell you about that. We'll we'll do that. We'll talk some more about that. We'll bring that back into the conversation. Crock pot ribs is on point. On point. You'll have some people licking their fingers like, oh, oh. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. Uh let's see. What's up, Caleb? What's going on? Yeah, I've been doing pretty good. I can't complain. I can't complain, you know. Life is what it be, but I can't complain, man. Everything is everything. Okay, I was trying to see if they had those little pumpkins. You see they got these little pumpkins over all of the, eh, all of the ones, at least in the continental 
and Canada got the little pumpkins over it. So should I go to Lone Star first? I feel like I should start at Lone Star, but it's saying Emerald Lake is the one on this mission right here. Scary kayaking. I'm going to click that for now, but I'm going to see what y'all talking about. Zuki, you say build your new PC. Hey, I will, man. Look, we get the parts, and I build the PC, man. <laughs> no problem. No problem. So yes, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go to Lone Star just to see. It's nothing. I mean, I can leave. You know, it don't cost much to go here. But I'm gonna go here first. Uh, what I got in my inventory? And we're gonna kind of figure this out as we go, guys. So y'all bear with me, rock with me, and we're gonna we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna figure this out. Let's go on a travel to Lone Star. Say so you finally home, so you can't complain. Still at 100, but better than you was. Okay, well, hey, at least you're getting there, man. Look, it take time, but you will be feeling better. You will feel better, so that's what's up. Uh, St. Croix Monster Hunt. Okay, to fright and delight. Buy this set and get loads of candy to catch bluegill skeletons, as well as a pine pass. Skeleton sweets guarantee a happy Halloween. 33 bait coins. So you seem like you got to invest some bait coins, it's looking like. Let me see what happens when I go here. I'm going to go to the nighttime, see what's going on. Uh, Let's see. Lone Star has two pumpkins and one grave. Okay. Can you find it during the daytime or is it all nighttime? Oh, okay. I see a pumpkin. All right. I see a pumpkin over there. And let's see if anything is right here. Let me get my free worms, though. Get my free worms, though. Joe, what's good, Joe? What's going on, man? I see a pumpkin across over there, and I see a pumpkin on this side. So let's run on over here, and we'll find that grave, too. See if we can spot that, guys. That's a lot of bait coins. Yeah, I know. I think you can earn bait coins, though, from, like, catching certain fish during this promo. And you can reinvest them because you got to, like, buy certain lures and all of that. All right, we found our first pumpkins. Oh, yo, that about scared me right there. Did y'all hear that? <laughs> Did y'all hear that? <laughs> all right, we got the candle in. We placing that in the backpack. Oh, you know what? I don't know if I needed to make sure I got some backpack room, too. 153. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to make sure I got some uh oh some backpack video. What's going on? What's going on? Hey, I'm doing well, doing well. How are you? How are you? All right, come back in 24 hours. Okay, so we got us a Halloween reward, and we got to find that tombstone. Where's the tombstone? Would it be hidden up in here? I've never even been up in here. Run around, run around, run around. Run around. Okay, is that it over there in the corner? Is that the tombstone? Because I'm not seeing anything else. All right, all right. So, yes, man, Halloween, the promo is here. You got to go around and find things and catch certain special fish. All right, at least you ain't got to wander long. Let's see if this make a noise. Oh, blade spinner. Okay, item placed in backpack. A one and one fourth ounce five aught blade spinner. Nice, nice. So we getting some nice loot, guys. We getting some nice, lo nice loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Now, this is an area people always recommend fishing for the, uh, for like the buffalo when you're looking for it and the catfish, fish over the fence. I've never done it, but I need to. And I'm going to do a video too. I asked people ask about like catching that buffalo again. We're going we gonna to see about that as well. Ah, can I get through here though? Okay. I thought this pumpkin was going to be on the other side. It's on this side. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, there we go. 
Let's see if this thing make a noise. That other one made a noise. All right, we got some candy. Cool, cool, cool. Let me see if that took up more slots in my inventory. Okay, 155. Yeah, I'm going to have to make some room. I'm going to have to make some room. I want to see this, though. Where is that lure we got? The lure and the candy. Where would the candy be? All right, this that blade one spinner. Okay. And it is one and one fourth ounce. So either my rides can use it. So we're going to fish. We're going to use that. We're going to throw that out at night and see what we catch. Bunch of broken bones. Okay, the pumpkin sound like zombies. Yeah, man, that pumpkin by had me jumping. Had me jumping. All right, wait until dark. Interact with the scarecrow. Let's see what was part of this mission. Okay, bring a candle in. So we got the candle in. Do we go ahead and take this to Emerald? I'm going I'm to go ahead to nighttime. I just want to see if you catch anything at nighttime while we're here or if it's nothing. We're going we gonna to confirm that before we leave. Let's see what it looked like at night. Okay, yeah, it don't look like nothing. See if we see any monsters. The pumpkin sound like zombies. Yeah, man. That about threw me off. All right, let's throw this blade one spinner on here. Luckily, this is a lure and not a um and not bait. So we shouldn't run out. I'm gonna catch this a couple times just to see if we catch anything. Otherwise, we're gonna go to Emerald. I might go to uh mud water too. I think it's something that where every lake, you just basically got to go around to all the lakes and collect. Maybe we'll do most of the collecting this time. We'll do more of the collecting, and then we'll, um, you know, in the next one, maybe we'll do a lot more catching. Well, we're going to do some catching in this one, too. All right. It don't look like nothing out here. For you guys who be looking for the buffalo, that's the spot right there. That um, that marker right there is one of the spots you can find buffalo. That's where I caught the mad eye buffalo. But yeah, man, how y'all doing, man? What has been going on today? Oh, I had something hit. All right, I got to throw it out one more time. I want to see what that was. See what that was. Oh, did you see that? Something lit up over there to the right. Something looked like some eyes or something, but they was glowing. Yo. Yeah, man. How y'all doing, man? How's your day been? And what have you been fishing today? What are you fishing right now, guys? What are you fishing? A uh, ghost pike at Emerald, Green Ogre, Gar at Naharan, and Albino at Florida. Albino Yeti at Florida. Okay. Yeah, not looking like much right here. I'm going to do one more cast. One more cast this way, and then we'll go ahead. I'm going to go by mud water. So I'm going to do the, the three or four lakes that are before Emerald, and we'll get pumpkins, and we'll see if there are any other lures like this blaze spinner. See what we find. See what we find. Let's see, you at the bad spot in Florida farming right now. Okay. Are you farming doing the Halloween stuff or are you just farming just regular? Regular schmegular. All right. We out. Let's get up out of here. If there is something to be caught here, I'll come back for it. Um... Emerald is what, like the fourth lake? So it should be three before that I go to Mudwater, Lesney. Oh, it's Rocky 2, level five. Okay, Mudwater. Okay, Emerald, the Heron. So I think I probably got to go to Lesney 2, this level four. 
Oh, that's right. None of these don't apply, so I don't have to go to Lesney. All right, cool, 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 cool. So, yeah, still will be a couple before. See, Lone Star, we'll go to Mud Water. See what's crackling that Mud Water. Luckily, these licenses aren't too much. The travel isn't too much. Uh, you doing both get money and farming the albino Yeti Gar. Need them candled ends too. Okay. Now, do you get candle ends for that? And are some of the fish, do they give you bait coins in this promo? Hunter, hey, what's up, what's up? Yo, y'all hear that? Man, this thing gonna make me fight. They lucky I ain't got nothing on me. All right, we got the Hawk Claw. Okay. Hey, they lucky I ain't had nothing on me the way that sounded. I don't like that. Yo, y'all hear that? Okay, them pumpkins. Man, these pumpkins sound, whoo. They lucky I ain't got nothing on me in this game. It'd be some problems. <laughs> It'd be some problems. Um, don't don't be don't be scaring me like that. All right, we got candy. Oh, okay, okay, so that's bait. So you go around, you catch your different baits. I got you, I got you. Uh, I might have to get rid of some things though. See what I can replace. What I can rebuy. Probably like these bass jigs. I could get rid of those. Let's see. Awesome brother here. Yes, yes. Uh, let's see. Hey, bro, there you are. Does anyone like chicken and dumplings because that is what you eat for dinner? Hey, nice. I like chicken and dumplings. That's that good good right there. Uh, go to Gent for fun. <laughs> no, we are not fooling with Gent. Uh, see, you get the candle ends from the pumpkins and the tombstones. Okay. Yes. Uh, not only cash and XP, okay, okay. And the angel, and angel is in the chat. Yeah, hey, nice, nice. A uh, bunch of creepy noises. Angler 1902 is here. What's up, Angler? What's going on? What's going on? Yummy, save me some. Chicken and dumplings, hey. Look, I just ate, what did I eat? Oh, I fixed tacos tonight. Was gonna do Taco Tuesday. Ended up eating something else. Oh, what is that? Sour bread. Okay. So ended up doing Taco Thursday. Did Taco Thursday today. They was good too. I fry up the shells myself. Try that. If you eat tacos, instead of buying the like the pre-made joints that you throw in the oven, buy the corn tortilla shells. And get like a small pan, put some cooking oil in it, sit the, the shell in there, you know, and let it start to brown a little bit, let it stiffen, and then fold one side, well, then flip it over. And as it starts to brown a little further, then fold one side, let that harden, you know, look much as you like it, and then fold the other side. And uh, form it into a shell, you know what I mean? The way you normally would eat a taco shell. Hey, it's banging, cook that for somebody, You'll get them like that. <laughs> They're they going to love it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, you fry your own shells. Yes, yes. Way better. Way better. Absolutely. Absolutely. Positively. Yo, these noises. These noises, though. Okay, I got to get something else out of my inventory, though. I got to make another spot. Uh, what don't I fish with? that often that I can replace. I hadn't even used this techno plank and I bought like 350 of these when I was carp fishing. Uh, corn, gonna use that. Marshmallows, a lot of these are like useful. Grasshoppers, I know I wanna throw the grasshoppers out. I can get more grasshoppers, maggots. All right, we'll buy more maggots. I'm gonna get rid of maggots. I know they got those in the store. Uh, let's see, night crawlers. Ah, I don't really want to get rid of any of this. Okay, that should give me enough room to get whatever is in these next two. And then when I get to my uh, inventory, when we go back to the home screen, we'll get rid of a few things. Ooh, skull jig. Okay, skull. 
Let me see. Do I still got room? Ah, I'm full. I'm full. I don't know if that's going to give me the same thing or not. All right, I got to make one more slot. One more slot. Uh, what can I get rid of? Duck muscle meat. That duck muscle meat kind of expensive, but ah, it's going to have to go. I hate to do it. I hate to do it. What's cheaper? What's cheaper? Small cut bait. We ain't used no small cut bait in a while. I'll replace the small cut bait. All right, let's see what's in here. Okay, that's just more sour bread. Well, oh well. We made room. All right, cool, 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 cool. So again, looks like you got to go around collecting your baits and whatnot. I'm going to go to the nighttime just to see. I just like to verify. Make sure ain't nothing out here. I'm going to throw this blade spinner. We'll throw this blade spinner. Just see if we get anything. I doubt it will, but we'll see. Let's see. You had some leftover chicken with turkey dressing, with turkey gravy, and green beans and cranberry sauce. Oh, nice. Nice. That's a little, little Thanksgiving-y. That's holiday-ish right there. That sounds good, though. Amanda, the next Chef Charles. <laughs> hey, you know it. You know it. I got a little bit of, little bit of culinary skill. Mom's taught me, she said, you know, if I, she wanted me to know how to cook, you know what I mean? So my mom's taught me when I was young, I used to cook for me and my sister, my little sister. And then I actually, I've worked in some kitchens before through my journey. I've done a lot. So yeah, I've worked in some kitchens, you know, I did the fast food before I've done restaurants, uh, the whole nine ran hot bars, like the whole nine. So yeah, I got a little diverse background. So it still transfers over when I need it to. All right. We're going to get out of here, guys. We've collected what we can collect from here. And I'm going to make me a little more inventory space. Let's see. You need that skull jig. Ah, oh, man. Uh, let's see. You hate the tube bait for bass. Timothy, what's going on? What's going on? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Hope all is well. Uh, let's see, I got a little bit of room. Uh, medium cut bait. Natural eggs. Let's see, that's trout. Gar burbot. I got the large cut bait. They'll eat both. I'm trying to think medium is good, though. Uh, bread with honey. All right, I'm going to bread with honey. Bread with honey got me through. Let's see, sweet pea, sweet corn, blood worms. Uh, I bought this grub for that mission, and it did work. But I'm going to go ahead and put that up. It's a three-eye, it's a four-eye. I'm going to keep the red one to three and the purple four to eight. So I put this one up. Uh, I got all these shads. I don't really need all of those. I got two glow in the darks, a one out to three and a two to four, basically the same thing. I put the this one up. We trying to make some room here. I got two crawls, a four to one, and a four to eight. Hmm. Very different sizes. I put this smaller one up. I don't think I need anything that small. Okay. Woo. My home inventory is filling up. I'm going to have to expand this. Let's see how much it costs to expand. 20. I'm going to have to use 20 bait coins just to, just to expand. You almost had 10 million cash. Woo! Shout out to Timothy. Almost got 10 million cash in Fishing Planet. Yo, the grind is real. The grind is real. Salute, man. You doing some real deal fishing. And saving. That's what you do, man. That's that's the grind right there. All right. Ah, uh, let's see. 2,000. I got 1 million, 7,000. It's going to take two off of that. Somewhere I'm going to have to do some fishing just so I can get some of my money back. I like it with it sitting over a million. Like, I'm going to have to grind that blue crab and just earn me another million so I never go below a mil. If it's possible.
Hey, Meteor. What's going on? What's going on? How goes it? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Let's see if I hear any of those crazy sounds. Right now we doing exploration, guys. We doing exploration, trying to find the bait that we need. It's really like pumpkins and tombstones, but it gives us those uh, the different types of bait, lure, and such that we need for this Franken fish. Hey, I don't see anything. Now this one had the pumpkin icon, but I don't see anything. Did y'all find anything at this lake? I haven't used any DLCs. I'm going to try to see what all you can actually do without buying anything, any of the bait coins or the DLCs. Now, are, and are you talking about DLCs for this Halloween promo or just DLCs in general? Man, don't tell me I done wasted my money coming here and ain't no doggone pumpkins here. Okay, there go the tombstone. I was about to say crocodile teeth. Okay. Yeah, it looks like for the right amount of bait coins, you can buy a lot of the bait and lure that you need. Or every day you're just gonna have to go around like this, and it's they basically time. You either sacrificing time or money because you have to go around find everything. Then when you use them, it looks like they're gonna be gone, so you can only catch so many fish. Let me catch a fish while I'm here. See if we catch anything with this spinner. It's probably too big for this lake. It is a five eye, but I'm gonna see if I at least get like a nibble. Oh, just any DLCs, okay. You want the 600 bait coin DLC? Yeah, I hear you. I want that thousand, that 2000. But that 600 would be nice too. Yes, Um. no, I haven't used any, well, I used one. I bought one DLC recently and that was the Amazon. Um, and what I may do going forward is when they drop new DLCs, if I'm not leveled up, I'll go ahead and get them. But that was the first DLC uh, and the only DLC. I have gotten premium, but um, I didn't get premium till I got the Amazon DLC. Uh, before that, I just totally fished off the grind. I was just grinding, never did premium, never did DLCs. The Amazon, if if you've never gotten a DLC or if you're th considering... That's one of the best ones because you get your level. If you're worried about leveling and getting money, that will get you started out in the right way because you'll make probably two, three million dollars depending on how much time you got to grind. And your level will go up crazy. Crazy. All right. But yeah, it looks like if you don't spend that Bitcoin money, you're going to be using time and your money money to go to these spots. Unless you really only choose to go to one lake, which like Lone Star Daily or something like that. But I'm not sure how this works, though. This this me kind of speculating partially. Let's see, Naharan Emerald. Okay, so what I did, let me tell you what I've done so far. I went to Lone Star, Mudwater, Rocky, and now we're going to hit Emerald Lake. Emerald Lake is on the mission list. Wait until dark. Find one candle in in pumpkins. Make sure to put it in your backpack. Approach the scarecrow. Sacrifice this item to start the terrifying pumpkin race. So it looks like we're going to do this race. Not sure how this is going to go. And then it give you a Quenchkin pass. Okay, Emerald Falcon St. Croix. Next on the list in San Joe, San Juan. Wait until dark and the scarecrow at the docks tell you how to do the scary race. All right, so we're going to knock this out. And then we'll see about this book, Travel to Quanchkin. Okay. All right, I think we're on the right path. I think we're on the right path. Uh, let me make sure I got some room. Okay, 151. I do have some room. Only four slots, but it is some inventory space. Let's see if there's anything else I can put up that I won't need at this moment. 
I, I won't really need this crab. Tarpon red drum. I just got to remember to get <laughs> to to put those crabs back in my inventory before I go to blue. 156 slots. Okay, we good. We good. So we going to Emerald, guys. Let's go ahead and buy this license. 900. Man, I I remember when going to Emerald, I used to be saving, and I thought I was going to go broke like 3000 and 900 for this license? Yo, that's too much. You know, I barely had like five Gs in the beginning. I was so scared to go to Emerald Lake thinking it was going to break me because mud water had uh, ran out a lot of my money. GA, what's up? What's up? Let's see. When did I start and when am I going to get off? Um, just started. We really only been on about 30 or so minutes. So I'll be going for a little while. Uh, Ted, what's up? You said you bought the Tropic Hunter. Was worth it, but waited to level 56. So you had three heavy chasers to farm the catfish. Ah, nice, nice. What lake does the Tropic Hunter take you to? Uh, re remind me. Uh, refresh my memory. I'm trying to remember that one. Amanda, does anyone eat Burger King anymore? <laughs> oh, GA. All right, G, I see you when you get back. Yeah, Amanda, let me tell you, I don't really eat fast food as often, like often at all, other than like Chick-fil-A. Um, Burger King, every now and then I get one of those cravings. You get one of them urges, and I'll go to uh, Burger King. But, I mean, it's very rare. It's far and few between. But, yeah, every now and then I get a craving like once a year, and I want me a Whopper. Give me a Whopper, a double Whopper. Oh, they gave us some maggots. Man, I just put some maggots up. I don't need those. Well, it looked like something that we need to catch. It's obviously attracted to maggots. But, yeah, every now and then I, I go and, you know, go to Burger King. I think when I went to the beach last time, we was on the way. was hungry or whatever. Stopped there. Now, they do got these little jalapeno papa things I like, though. I ain't going front. They, they, I might go back again for that. But yeah, BK, man, back in the day, Burger King's burgers was like extremely on point. I think what has failed most fast food places is in the quest for more money. They started buying cheaper meats. They used to get like better qualities of food. And they decided that it was uh, collecting this or night. Okay, they decided it was more important to, you know, get the money. And uh, in doing so, they sacrificed quality. And that's why I like a lot of the food declined in the taste. Uh, McDonald's, too. You know, back in the day, years ago, McDonald's had real burgers. And then they started selling slime burgers. And once they started doing that, uh, the quality dwindled, you know, it dwindled quite a, quite a bit. I seen a pumpkin over here. That's why I done jumped on uh, the boat. Let me make sure ain't nothing over here in the cup. Because, you know, it, something got to be wrong when a restaurant has to advertise that they have real meat. I don't know if y'all remember, but like a year or two ago, uh, maybe three, four at this point, McDonald's was advertising, we've got, you know, real beef. What's the uh, what's the meat called? Uh, Angus. We've got Angus burgers. We have real meat. So are you telling me that for the last 10 years you've been selling me fake meat? Is that what you're saying? All right, you gonna have me. <laughs> you gonna have me going on and on about stuff like that. All right, let's see. We got okay. Another hawk claw. Okay. All right, let's see what's in ya, in ya, and ya. Yeah, you don't know what you be eating now. I don't know if y'all ever watched Super Size Me. Ooh, moldy cheese. When Super Size Me was breaking down. Uh, what they have in they and they burgers, them slime burgers, it'll make you think twice about it. I ain't saying I ain't never ate there before or since, but yeah, you definitely wanna wanna think about what you're eating. All right, let's see. Uh, you at Marin? Okay, yeah, I'm ready to get to Marin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm almost there. I'm uh, I am level sixty. I gotta get to sixty three. Still gonna probably take you know a week or so, but. Once I get to 63, I'm going to keep grinding that blue crab, you know, in between the streams. Once I hit level 63, it's on. 
Marin is the next best one. They say it's better than, oh, look at how my ride bends. Yo, that's cool. They say uh, Marin is even better than Blue Crab. I got Maku Maku open, but Maku Maku is kind of trash. It, it's it's not terrible. You know, the Arrow Pimas, you can catch them. But, yes, yeah, it's, it's trash. <laughs> Angler. What up, Angler? Let me join Angler's room. Oh, am I already in here? Maybe I'm already in here. Is that Angler out there? Yeah, I guess I'm already in here. I guess I joined and didn't realize it. Nice. All right, guys, we're going to fast forward to the nighttime because the nighttime is the right time, and we're going to see what's up with this. Ooh, look at the spook. How I make my... How I make the interface go away? It's a way to make the interface go away. There it is. Ooh, look at the ghost. Look at the scarecrow. This is a good screenshot right here. It's a good screenshot. All right, let's holler at this pumpkin and sacrifice the items uh, we found to begin the terrifying pumpkin race. All right, let's sacrifice. <laughs> Start your race. Press Y. Uh-oh. Let me bring my interface back up. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. All right, look at those pumpkins bobbing in the water. You need to destroy them so they won't scare anglers. Smash the pumpkins by driving your kayak through them. But keep track of time. All right. We get that the, the, the triple six number and we get a bait coin. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, there's a lot of them. Yo, and the clock ticking. The clock is already ticking. Yo, get that out of here. The clock is already ticking. All right, let's go. Let's go. Yo, I got to get all these? Okay, I just got to smash 10. Okay. All right, one. Let's go. Let's go. We racing, we racing. We racing, two. I think we can do this, y'all. Let's see those darn bluegills suck. <laughs> yeah, you only caught four catfish, dang. Gang roomie, Amir, what's up? What's going on? What's going on? What's good with you? Marin is the best for XP money, even over Willow, due to not spending 60k on bollies. Yeah, man, I wasted a lot of money on those bollies uh, because that carp tournament. And so I started fishing carp. As soon as that tournament was over, though, I haven't fished any more carp at all. Like, other than if I was at uh, San Joaquin, and I don't really be there like that. I probably went the long way. I'm used to like going to the outskirts. I've worked landscaping too, so you usually do the perimeter and work your way in. I didn't realize that how far these would be. Like, I should have just stayed over there. Uh, what is this? Six, seven, eight, nine. If it's 10 over here, I'll just finish over here. It looks like it's not, so I'm going to turn right. All right, we good. I mean, they give you ample time, it looks like. They give you ample time. All right, let's go, let's go. Two more. I'm going to head back towards the pier. Looks like we good, guys. Oh, that's it? That's it? Okay, rumor has it there's an abominable monster fish that would devour anything alive. If you're human, only opportunity, blah, blah, blah. Head to San Joe. Okay. Uh, find a witching recipe book. So this is the only time we got to do this, or do we have to do others? It said there's some other lakes. Shouldn't I do all of those? Or do I need to just go ahead for the Frankenfish? Two other races. Okay. 
Hey, you caught a oh, you caught a five pound chain pike. Nice, nice, very nice. So if I do this again, do I get another bait coin though? And more money? Can you keep doing the race over and over again? Because if that's the case, I mean, we won a bait coin. Let's see. We did that. Why well, I didn't get my credit? Hey, what's up, King J? What's going on? What's going on? Falcon and one more. Okay. Uh, you fishing blue gears for your last mission before the Franken fish. Complete the terrifying. Now, why they ain't give me credit? Bring the candle, wait until dark, interact with the scarecrow. Complete the terrifying pumpkin ray. It didn't give me credit for this. That other thing popped up, and it's like it didn't give me credit. Shuffle, what's going on? What's going on? Yo, how y'all doing? But look, why didn't it give me credit though, Gerald? You see, it didn't say, it don't say I've completed the pumpkin race. Is it because that pop-up came up too soon? Because I thought I needed one more pumpkin. I had only had nine. Let me look at my inventory. Where my uh where these candles at, man? Yo, that's jacked up. They did me like that. I don't even know where the candles are. I'm gonna have to leave here and go back and find some more candles. Ha. Uh, they got me, guys. They got me. See, it did that glitch to you, too. Yeah. That's dirty, ain't it? Hey, you just finished the American Truck Sim? Finished it like completed it or just finished playing? <laughs> Man, they played me. That was very dirty. That was very dirty. I'm not going left this time. I'm going to the right. We going a different path, but that was dirty. What's up, GA? Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, it'll let me do it again without the candle. Okay. Okay. Just finished playing. I still never really played and got on. Um, I own American truck driving sim. I also own uh European truck driving sim. I think I got them in like a bundle or something like that. Never played them. I get games. I played bus driving sim. Actually played that. I got my wheel and everything. It's back there. You you can't see it. That's my my music. That's for my music. But uh, I got the steering wheel hooked up over there. But yeah, I've never actually uh played European or American. My guy Jimmy Daly though, he played like crazy. He get fleets together and play and stream. I don't know if you're familiar with Jimmy, but yeah, he go hard on the uh, the truck driving sims. Uh, you went back and watched the video. You didn't get it. Yeah. I say we need to play together. I need to get on it, man. I just haven't. And I wasn't even close to the pier, though. Like, that's what's jacked up. They act like I was, like, on the pier. I was not on the pier. They got you, boy. But that's all right, because we about to do it here. We about to do it here. We got to do it again. We going to do it again. Hey, guys, y'all smash that like button for me, too. Like, subscribe, share, do all that good stuff, man. Feed that YouTube algorithm. Y'all know it helps. Y'all know it helps. Now, if it pop up again before I run into the last pumpkin, oh, it's going to be a problem. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, cool. That's cool they give you a day pass. Uh, everything is as it should be. Okay, okay. Got the pumpkin bobber. Okay, uh, wait until darkness and find two candle ends 
and one noose in the pumpkins or tombs. Don't forget to put them in your backpack. Okay. Pumpkin Ray Skull Baba. St. Croix. All right. So I guess I got to go to Falcon to find the two candle ends and the noose. Let's see. Bring the candle in. Bring the noose. Okay. Now, hey, are they located? All right, Amanda, have a good one. Have a good one. Get you some rest. Hope you have a great tomorrow. Peace and blessings. And thank you for stopping through. Now, should I go to Falcon? Are they, is Falcon going to have the candle in and the noose, or do I need to go somewhere else? Do I need to go to the other lakes for that? Uh, let's see. Probably not need to check him out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, check him out. That's one of my guys. He a, he a OG gamer, uh, but he he plays a little bit of everything. He hardcore on them sims, construction sim, American truck driving sim. Uh, he played like all them them just like random simulators that came out. Jimmy B's on all of them. And kind, what did I do? <laughs> what was that about? All right, let me get up out of here. Yeah, with his channel, he plays like every game, but he'll play like 30 minutes. I, I used to do that too on my channel as well, kind of premiere games, but he played a little bit of everything. And then he got the certain ones that he liked that he'll play pretty heavy. All right, it's time to go to Falcon. Time to go to Falcon. Let's hit Falcon. Let's buy the license. Oh, they cutting into my money. Oh, it's going to hurt to watch this money drop down. Oh, it's going to hurt. Under a milli. No. Uh, they are random pumpkin and tomb drops. You can find them in any pumpkin tombs. Uh, you might hop off in a bit to eat and watch a movie. Okay, Jake. Hey, appreciate it, man. Appreciate you stopping through. Go and enjoy yourself. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Uh, let's see. Might need to get us a group together since we have multiplayer. Yeah, I'm with it. I mean, I, well, I'm going to be honest. Let me say it like this. Now, I I, I haven't played like that. I told you, I ain't never really played it. So I don't want to be messing up the caravan and all of that because I ain't familiar with driving the big rig. You know? I probably shouldn't have came here first. I probably should have hit a different lake. Uh, now that I think about it, but whatever. We're going to be spending some money, guys, jumping around to some of these lakes. Because, yeah, I don't see any pumpkins or scarecrows. Oh, okay, it's over there. It's over there. But I still don't know if they're going to have the two candle ends. Okay, here go one. That's a bat wing. That ain't no candle ends. You say it's easy. All right. All right. I just say I ain't trying to be smashing off the road, wrecking everybody. Who was that? I was watching somebody play the little truck driving simulator and... You know, you get them griefers and them uh them cats that come in there and be messing with your caravan, driving, they, they in a car, and they be trying to harass, you know, and uh, what is it? I just say griefing. They be griefing you. Okay, there go the scarecrow. And uh, the dude was on him. Dude was running his caravan, though. The dude was like the leader dude. He was like talking to him like, I'm going to report you. If you don't leave us alone, dude went and dipped, but he was trying to run him off the road and run his car into him. It was crazy. Uh, let's see. Just listen for the music clues. Okay, music cues. Uh, you had a shift the steering wheel pedals as well. Let's see. They random. Should have went to Quanchkin first. Now I have to come back there twice. Yeah. Oh, well. Again, luckily, I got a little bit of change, even though I don't like seeing it disappear. So if I should go to Quanchkin first, okay, I'll run to Quanchkin. 
Because I said, I don't know the full process. I'm learning this as I go. I'm learning it with you guys. So I'll run the Quashkin and see what's there. Hey, Gerald. Now, if I go to Quashkin, that's not going to put me in a bad position with the race. Will I be able to catch something or find some more items that we need at Quashkin? Let's see, you get on private convoy now with Mighty Trucks. Okay. Yeah, Jimmy, he premieres a lot of those trucks and shows the uh, how you can put the different wraps on them, you know, the different paint jobs. It's pretty cool. Uh, Yes, have to finish the book mission. Then it unlocks about seven more missions for the other lakes. Okay. So, but if I go to Quanchkin, that'll be me working on a book mission. Okay. Travel to Quanchkin, wait until dark, catch catfish using sour bread, moldy cheese, dry locust. I don't have that many of those sour bread, moldy cheese, dry locust. I, I found a few. I'm going to show you. I have, let's see, I got 10 candies. Okay, I got five moldy cheeses, 10 sour breads. Five moldy cheeses, 10 sour breads. And no locusts. I haven't found any locusts. So, shoot, it looked like I might not be able to do as much as I want to because of the limitations. And if I buy some of these Halloween, let's see, 99 bait coins, 20 bait coins, the witch's treats. Okay. I could use the 20 bait coins for this. Is there any other way to get these besides just going around to the lakes? Because it looks like that is the governor. That's the filter. You got to go around to the lakes, but you can't do it but once a day, and it's going to cost. It's going to get real expensive to be traveling around to all these lakes uh, just to barely get one or two items. I see what they're doing. I see what they're doing. Uh, do I have his YouTube? Yeah, it's a Jimmy Dali, D-A-L-I. And just look up like truck driving simulator and stuff like that. Any of the truck driving, any of the simulators. And uh, he got it. Let's see. Yes, it has like three or five loot items. Buy the 20 bait coin pack. Uh, fish with small hooks for catfish. Because even channel catfish count. Oh, okay. Uh, money grab Halloween event. Yeah. So you got to go. Need to walk your dog. All right, GA. No worries. No worries. I'll see you when you get back. Okay, so if I go ahead to Quanchkin, I'm going to go to Naharan first just to... Ah, oh, is Naharan on the mission list? St. Croix, San Joe. Okay. Naharan. I know it opened up some other ones at Naharan, but I'm going to go to Naharan just to see if I can get some of these locusts or some more of the moldy bread. What's up, Global? What's good? What's good? So you about to eat muffins and chicken, macaroni, banana pudding. Nice. <laughs> nice. Let's see. Catch catfish using sour bread. So you said any catfish counts, even if I don't catch them using this exact bait. Fish with small hooks for the catfish. Three and four, because even the channel catfish count. Or do I need to use these? I got to use sour bread, moldy cheese, dry locusts, or can I catch the catfish with anything? I would assume not. I'm going to run in the heron. I'm trying to hit these cheaper lakes. Okay, you have to use the bait. All right. Yeah, they making you spend your money up. They making you spend your money up, man. They know what they're doing. Or you either got to spend the bait coins, which is going to take more money. More money, more money, more money.
Uh, but if you if you target the smalls, you can still get big and maximize the bait. You have to catch them. Okay. Naharan, NC. We in North Kakalaki. See if I can find these pumpkins and these tombstones. They need to have more little Easter eggs at these uh, different lakes you can find, whether it's just free bait, you know, or something. Let's see. Let's see if I see that pumpkin. Okay, I see a pumpkin over there. Make sure I ain't miss anything. All right, here go here go a hidden pumpkin right here. Bat wings, dog on it. I don't need no bat wings. <laughs> the bluegill mission will enrage you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is kind of jacked up. Like, you would literally have to go around for multiple days buying multiple licenses and traveling just to get this little bit of bait. It's kind of dirty. All right, moldy cheese, good, good, good. Moldy cheese, good, good, good. Anything in this tent? Yo, what's up? What's going on? Yeah, these are just fetch missions. So, I can go to Quanchkin. I do at least have moldy cheese. I got to know. I just don't have the the other grasshopper thing they said. But I do have at least moldy cheese and sour bread. I have enough that theoretically I should catch those six. I just and maybe at Quanchkin if I go there, hopefully it would have the. The dry locust, because right now I'm just missing them. And I think about getting this. And it's only 13. That's trash. 13 sour bread, 13 motor cheese. Nah, I go around and just spend my money, at least for now. Okay, the monster guards. Oh man. Pig's eye. Okay. They gonna run you around quite a bit, it looks like. Do it yourself potion making kit. Oh yeah, them slimy cranks. Okay, I got blood leeches. Or they should at least let you be able to catch like certain fish or something and harvest. You know, harvest these items out of them so you don't have to, like, going around and finding them, okay, they did make that a way to get them without having to spend or use bait coins. But you should also be able to maybe catch certain fish or the same way when we doing the monster where we catch certain uh, trash in the lake or something and it allows you to make some of these, the rats at the bottom, the bat wings. Some way to get these besides this and other than just wandering and having to pay for the pumpkins. But they do give you the pumpkin option, so I, I can't be totally mad. But still. But I get it. Again, it's a promo. They trying to make that money. Cooper, what's up? What's up? You caught the 8 uni at the Everglades the other night. Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. Yeah, what's going on? What's going on? Uh, let's see, it'll finish that mission. Okay. Go. 
Hey, what's up, Gup? How you doing? How you doing? How you been making it on 2K2? Ah, 30,000. Goodness. Repair all my items for 30K. Let me look. I got to look at these. Oh, goodness gracious. It's a lot of money. Oh, well. Easy come, easy go. Yeah, I've been on 2K a bit too. First season, I got that Carmelo grinded. I'm putting the footage up. I'm still editing it. I'm going to start putting some of that first season footage up, man. I kind of wanted to just finish it out. It was a lot of grinding to get that card. Let's see. We did in the Heron, Emerald St. Croix, Rockies. No really other cheaper lakes that I can go to. White Moose. Mm. Everglades. I at least don't have to buy a license if I go to White Moose. Even though it costs 78 to travel, I don't have to buy the license. Yo, what's up, Big? Big Biz, what's good? What's good? Don't buy the DIY kit, it's trash. Okay, yeah, I ain't gonna do that. Jacob, gotta go. All right, have a good one. Have a good one. See you on the later on. Peace and blessings, and have a good tomorrow. I'm gonna run the White Moose. I'll come back. Again, I don't have to buy the license, so, I mean, it is 8 Gs. I might have to, what, jump on the boat and go across the lake? Let's see. Let us see. Global say you reached level 50 on the Fisherman. Nice. Go up. Sorry you haven't been in the stream. Been grinding 2K22 <laughs> till it's 11. Uh, got off early because you've been tired in school. I remember those days. I used to get 2K and uh, be up all night playing it, grinding up my player. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I did get two candle ends. I just need the noose. Yeah, I'd be up all night grinding my player up, man. I remember those days. Remember those days. I'd be trying to, like, first night get my joint to 99. And then older 2Ks, before they, of course, got on the money train, you could you could about level your dude up in like a night. Two, three max. I used to be able to 99 a player. But they took all that out. <laughs> they took, you know, nice pay to win. All right. It looks like it's going to be some more pumpkins across the lake, guys. We just doing a lot of exploring. Uh, if I buy the twenty dollar Halo pack, you get two feeder, a spinner. Okay, might have to check that out. All right, we're gonna ride across the other side of the lake. Again, look like they hit you either way, cause either way, you either gonna need a bunch of bait coins which you got to earn or use the one, you know, the ones you've earned or buy, or you got to spend a bunch of money going around to the lakes. But what we done spent already about 50 K to go and check out these pumpkins. Yeah. I hear you pumpkins. All right. We got a pig's eye. I still need those grasshoppers. I'm going to see if this thing will catch a uh, trout real quick. See if we can catch a trout or if this thing only attracts the, the Halloween fish. Pike sit right here too. Uh-oh. Hey, we got a something. Got a something. Yeah, okay. Got us a nice northern pike. Yeah, if you ever come here to do that mission where you need like a trophy pike, you need to come over here. You can do it off the boat. You don't have to get uh, on the shore. But all of these markers right here are basically pike markers. A couple of them might be some trout. 
or salmon, but they basically the pike markers. I caught that trophy trout over here. I just had to catch something, man. It's been a minute. Oh, got another hit right at the end. It's probably another pike. Yeah. All right, we caught us a couple pike. At least we're trying to get some of our money back. Let me throw this way out here, see if we uh hit a trout. 121. It's not very far. Where y'all at, Trout? Where y'all at, Trout? All right, nothing on the Trout. Let's go ahead and uh, knock off some of these catfish. We're going to head to Quanchkin. And while I'm at Quanchkin, I might grind some guard just to get some of my money back while I'm there. We are heading to Quanchkin. Because I did all the cheapest lakes. And I did white moose, even though it's a little expensive. Because I had a license and don't have to buy that. Uh, let's see. Thanks for the Naharan tutorial. You got a uni. <laughs> Smiley on the first cast with the Swamp Green Shad. Nice, nice. That's what's up. Hey, glad I could help. I said a lot of those I had to figure them out. And so, yeah, really, really glad that I can help. Oh, we got the pine pass. Oh, that's cool. Well, at least you save a little change coming here, even though I still got to eat that travel cost. Let's see. You doing the same. Okay. Uh, Skeleton Sweets, St. Croix Monster Hunt. To Friday Light, by this set, bluegill skeletons, as well as park pass. Okay. Thank you, but no thank you. We're going to look around this lake real quick, see if we see any more pumpkins, and then we'll go after those. Uh, we'll go after whatever the fish was, the catfish that we need to catch with this uh, bait that we've procured. Yeah, this swampy lake. Ah, oh, somebody caught the vampire gar ghost pike. Oh, I meant to fish those other lakes while it was dark. This lake actually really fits the bill for this uh, challenge. It's all swampy. All right, I'm going to just keep spining in at these different spots. Till we hear them pumpkin. There you go. More moldy cheese, okay. It's something I got to, oh, you know what? It's a mission. I've been bouncing around these lakes. I'm trying to focus on this, and and I'm the type of guy, because I micromanage, I do a lot. I jump around, but there are some missions I need to do, some of these new mastering missions, and a bunch of them was at Quanchka. I need to get this chain picker that's 3.3. I might could do to go in and do that. This new one opened up. The Trophy Bass 2, after I did Trophy Bass 1, the Heron just left there. I ain't went to the Everglades. Quanchkin. But again, I don't want to put the time into that just yet. The Labrax Quanchkin, the White Bass, 2.2 San Joe. I'm going to probably do these before I leave, though. I think Quanchkin going to be the last stop for the night. I do want to do some of these, though. But, ah, we got the promo going, so I kind of want to keep it on the Halloween promo. For these next few streams, but I, I gotta do these as well, San Joe. Yeah, but it's three things I can do here at Quanchkin. Depending on how this turn out, we might go ahead and do some of those too. All right, so we got that first pumpkin. I've been here, here. We just gonna circle all the way around and make sure we find all of the pumpkins and all of the tombstones, all the king's horses and all the king's men.
CT, what's going on? What's going on? Uh, you say you're doing the same. You on PC right now. You'll be on Xbox later. Oh, bitch, you getting your grind on for real. Uh, bottom left place has two tombstones and a pumpkin. Okay. Gar Spot has a pumpkin and Float Heaven has a pumpkin. What's going on, CT? Swampy open space, not Float Heaven. Okay. I'm going to keep circling around. Let's see, down south. Ah, yeah, it is the Gar Spot. At the Gar Spot. Woo, 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 woo. Oh, we got a dead mouse. Gar Spot, yeah. Make sure I still got room. Move notification. Oh, I'm full. I am full. Before I get the next one, I'm, I'm going to have to make some room. In fact, let me do that now. I'll go on it. Uh, what can I get rid of? Crawfish, dead mice. I'm going to have to do something with this duck muscle meat. This duck muscle meat is good. I don't really want to get rid of that. Small, you know, techno plank to spend a lot of money on that. Peas, corn, sweet corn, semolinas. Pet food good for catfish. <sighs> I guess I can always get some more semolinas. See, mole, cricket, larvae. I don't want to get rid of anything, y'all. I'm bad. All right. I'm going to just have to get rid of. Let's see. When am I going to catch some more carp? Sweet peas. Uh, blood worms. Blood worms are very useful. But I'm going to have to go ahead and get rid of these blood worms. Yeah, we'll do that. All right, blood worms. We got to buy some more blood worms. Let's go. So we got that. We're going to keep working our way around the pecan hut. Uh, do we see any pumpkins or tombstones at the end of these? Of these? Oh! Oh! And that thing be scaring me. I ain't going to even front. All right, we got the candy. I got that alligator skull. Can I actually walk over here? Let's see. Let us see. Let us see. Ooh, we can. Is this always like this, or did they extend it for the uh for the promo? Okay, more sour bread. Nice. Crocodile teeth. Dog on it. Ooh, silicone spider. I got a drying rack over here. They drying some meat. That's probably what? Lizards, rats, alligators. All right, and I'm going to hit this good old tobacco spot. Oh, that's where we at. Oh, they drying tobacco. Uh, let's see. Pumpkin by the shack. Okay, you broke your reel today, Emerald. Ah, man. For Lake Trash. Okay, I tried it. I do. I got this bat wing, got the candle in, the crocodile teeth. Do I not need the bat wing and the crocodile teeth? Oh, I can trash those. They are taking up inventory space. But I assumed I, I needed them for the promo. Uh, gotta go to the, okay, this is the gar spot right here. I need a noose. Trying to hit this catfish spot. Right here, right here. Yo, I'm trying to get my catfish spot. This is the catfish spot right here. It's not the catfish spot. It's 
right here. Okay, here we go. All right, I'm going to go ahead for some of these catfish and just do what I can do. And when I get the dry locust, I'll come back and go after that. What's up, can't see me? What's going on? Uh, let's see, you want to get the kayak, but you can't unlock sand. Why yet? Ah, oh, that's jacked up. Oh, we got a couple people right here. Let me uh do a friend's room. Get out these people away. All right, so we're going to set the stand up, guys, and we're going to catch what we can catch for tonight. Move over this way a smidge. Right here will work. Oh, I'm supposed to wait until dark. Let me set my rides up. Uh, I'm going to assume these hooks I got are fine. They are larger hooks. If I need to go smaller, do I need to go smaller? Okay, with the catfish, use floats as well. Three. Okay, three eyes. All right. I'll go with a smaller hook. Shoot, what about this claw hook? The hawk claw. I mean, in this area, though, I've caught catfish with the 8, with the 10, and the 6. I don't have a 4. I'm going to go with a 6. I got two. I don't have threes, though. I put this two on this float. I did three and four. I left five and six the same. Let's see. We'll put moldy cheese on that one. Sour bread on that one. And on the float. What I have more of, more moldy cheese. So we'll put the moldy cheese on that one. Uh, do you have a rod and reel guide on your channel? Uh, no, I don't. I actually need to make one. Oh, I got to go to the nighttime, guy. Let me go to nighttime. Don't y'all let me forget. All right, it's nighttime. Catch catfish, all right? So, yeah, this is what we'll do. Again, because I'm kind of stuck, because I don't have the dry locust, and to do the other kayaking missions, I need... um. I got the two candle ends, but you needed a noose, which means I'm going to have to keep going around. And it looks like this stuff, you randomly, you know, you randomly get it as you go to these pumpkins. I could buy it. I'm going to try to do this without buying it and see how many we can actually catch doing it the hard way. Trying to conserve my bait coins. I was doing a lot of spending on my bait coins with uh, markers and uh, what else was I doing? Yeah, I was doing a lot of spending the bait coins with markers and expanding, uh, expanding my inventory. So we're gonna catch these with the sour bread and this cheese, and it probably won't be till tomorrow when I go around to get the dry locust. Had I known yesterday, see, yesterday I was busy, but the promo started. But I wanted to stream. I wanted to do all this with you guys. So I didn't go around. I said, I'm going to just wait till we stream. We'll do it all together. Once I figure it out, then I'll go around by myself. Like tomorrow, if we don't stream, I'll go around and continue to collect, you know, save up some money, grind, and keep collecting all of what we need. Then we'll fish like this, fish for the Frankenfish, uh, do the kayak missions together. But I would have went around yesterday and collected had I had known. Had I had known, but, you know, you live and learn.
Throw this blade spinner out, see if we catch anything. Hey guys, you jumping in, if you coming in, you in and yeah, you coming, going, hanging, hit that like button for me, guys. Hit that like button, subscribe, follow, all that good stuff. Y'all know we got to feed these algorithms. All right, Catfish, come on. Let's see. And if I need to, I will go ahead and uh, decrease these hook sizes. I got two more, so I may go ahead and, uh, oh, something going on. There we go. There we go. Oh, both of them going off. Nice, nice, nice. Come on in. Just come on in. Bam. Got us a trophy. Nice, nice, nice. That trophy channel. We got us one sour bread, one moldy cheese. This is like a flathead. Is that a flathead? Flatheads can be decent money, especially the unis and the trophy. Oh, and the other one going off. Nice. Let's go on and throw this out. Bam. Just a little catfish. Come here, little catfish. All right, two for moldy cheese. Let's see, you have spent a week real time in the heron trying to catch the trophy and uni fish like the flathead, small mouth, okay. Uh, long nose gar, <laughs> and you fail. Ah, man. It happens. It happens. When you targeting your fish and whatnot, it does happen. You know, trying to find the one that you're looking for. Change this hook real quick. Throw another sour bread out there. Let's see. I got a ride that I'm missing. There we go. There we go. Yeah, you'll get it, see me. Again, the more you learn the game, the the easier it'll be to catch a lot of these fish. Uh, Big B say, how did I make my thumbnails? I make them myself. Um, You know, I just composite, take some different stuff and put it together. Hey, what's up, Summer? The bluegills are cursed. Just crash your game. Ah, oh, ah, oh, that's jacked up, Gerald. Summer, you say they got twist drops for fishing. Oh, okay. I did that when the first ones came out. Do they do it monthly? Do they change it? Cause I'm gonna have to uh check on that. I got the first drops. If they got some Halloween drops, that'll be great for this Halloween promo. How you been doing, Summer? What's been going on with you? Oh, this might be a uni right here, guys. This one a big 
This one a big one. Ah, oh, man. Had me thinking it was a big one. Uh, let's see. You enjoy it more when you go to a place and catch them when you're not trying to catch them. Hey, I feel you on that. Say, making your rounds before you go to bed. That's what's up. We got the moldy cheese working. The moldy cheese is working. Okay, well, I don't know if they did it a second time or not. Because, again, I know they did it at first. So I, so I don't know if this one is the same one. Or if it's a... Uh, if it is a different one in regards to these drops. But I'm glad they did do the drops. I think that's dope. We got another one going off. Again, we only need two more for the moldy cheese. Okay, this is sour bread. So that'll add two to sour bread. Uh, you cannot get back in the fishing plan that gets you off the bed. All right, Jerry, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Uh, three horror boxes until the 22nd of October. Bro, you said, oh, okay. Hey, Summer, thanks for letting me know that because that is some stuff we can use. Guys, before you go, uh, even Gerald, they have twist drops. Oh, this is probably a uni. Twist drops and you get Halloween. You get three hard boxes. So it got to be stuff for this Halloween promo. So that's probably lure bait, all of that. So if you guys haven't done that, do that. Do that. Yeah, do that. I'm going to do that tonight. Most of the time it's just watching. Y'all can probably be getting them right now or working towards it uh, with all of the twist drops. Let me pick this up. I only need one more for moldy cheese. Okay, that's sour bread. All right, moldy cheese right there. So I'm going to change my other ones to uh, sour. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. I understand some, but it's just good to know. Yeah, thanks for letting me know, and I can let everybody in here know that they do got twist drops that'll get you some of the bait for this promo. Since they're horror boxes, I don't, I haven't confirmed it, but since it's horror boxes, I would bet I put some money on it that it got to be Halloween stuff until the twenty second. Hold on, what's today? Oh, that's only like a day. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get on that uh, ASAP. ASAP. Russell, what's up, Russ? What's going on? What's going on? We back at it again. Yeah, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Can't complain. Staying busy. Work. You know how it is. Uh, living life out here with, with, you know, everything going on. But, yeah, I can't complain. I can't complain. Uh, working and 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 grinding streaming you know you know keeping them lights on and everything keeping the family fed you know how it is i've caught a few today because of this halloween promo we've been running around and finding items they basically have like pumpkins and tombstones around at the different lakes and then it's like a special fish you got to catch but to get the special fish, you got to do certain missions. And to do the missions, you got to run around and get the stuff or spend some money, of course. You know, you can always spend some money. Or you can go around to the lakes, which costs your in-game currency. So it's a little balance. And uh, see, I ain't caught nothing super big today. But if I still do a little regular fishing, I'll probably catch us a, a, a little baby monster or two. Oh, what a twist drops. Uh, let's see. You want to get into his server, but are you on PC? Yeah. Yeah, it'd be great if you guys could come through. Y'all could come join me uh, in the friends room, but I am on PC. Uh, twist drops. So, twist drops, and I can pull it up when we get done or before we jump off. 
Twist drops are something new that they implemented where certain games, not just Fishing Planet, there are a lot of games, and if you watch content creators play the game on Twitch, you get free in-game loot, all right? So, for instance, the Fishing Planet already did one at the beginning. It was in, like, September, and you got, like, three crates, and it had, like, lure and bait in it. I think it had some bait coins. I can't remember. Don't quote me on that. I recorded it, and um, I just ain't put the – I need to put the footage up, but I recorded doing it. Okay, we got all of the moldy cheese, guys, so now we're going to switch – I'm going to switch this to uh, sourdough. But, yeah, you get free stuff in game. So you'll get free stuff in Fishing Planet just for watching a streamer. Like, y'all could be literally getting it right now for me because I got it enabled. The person streaming has to have uh, the Twitch drops enabled. And if they're enabled, you can watch them and get credit towards it. So, for instance, to get the first one, I had to watch. If you watch 30 minutes, you got the small box. If you watch uh, an hour, you got the medium box. If you watch the hour and a half, you got the large box. And if you watch two hours, you got the extra large box. So, you know, it's the ways to do it easily. Like, you literally could just turn it on and just let it play. You know what I'm saying? And you don't have to watch the same person. I found that out, too. So, for Fishing Planet, you got to watch people playing Fishing Planet. So I was watching one dude play Fisher Planet, and then he he logged off. You know, he quit after about 45 minutes of me watching. So I went to somebody else's channel, and it kept going. So it runs concurrent. It isn't like you got to watch one person for two hours because they could, they could quit. Um, but again, not sure of the time watch frame on this. And it can be different stuff. Some stuff you can do playing or doing inter different types of interactions with the streamer. But yeah, Twist Drops get you in-game loot. For a lot of different games. It was other games on there. Uh, RTSs. Uh, strategy games. Shooting games. Like it's all kind of joints. Oh it's not new. Okay they got a link their Twitch to the game. Okay. Well it was new to me. It was new to me. Um, I only discovered it like a month or two ago. And the way they was promoting it. I thought it was new. Okay you link Twitch to their game. Okay. And you can look at the current drops campaign. It's a lot of them. It's like a whole list of games that you could check out. Again, I can pull it over if you want to see it while we waiting. Just so you can see it. Let me see if I can find it over here. Hey, Ty, thank you for the follow. You are elite. See if I can find my Twitch drops. Twitch drops, Twitch drops. Oh, we got another hit. We got another hit. Yeah, and when you click on your name in Twitch, the drop down that pops up, you'll see drops. It's like one of the, it's one of the uh the headers or one of the options that you can choose. When you click on your name and like you would go to settings or whatever, whatever, your dashboard. As you look, scroll down, you'll see drops. But this thing going to be, uh, show you this real quick. So, like, if you look in here, if you click on your drop down right here, and then it'll, it'll say drops, and then you can see the campaigns. So, this was the one with Fisher playing it, giant box, large box, medium box, and I had to just watch people. And then it's like more campaigns. You can look at Dwarf, Ham, Humankind, World of Tanks, Goose Goose Duck, Fortnite, Project Genesis, Tom Clancy, Madden. They got Madden drops, Smite, Paladins, Fishing Planet, Rocket League, Elder Scrolls, FIFA. 
Here go the clothes campaigns. Uh, so let's see what the new one is. Creepy box, horror box, monster box. Okay, how to earn a drop. Go to participating live channel. Watch 30 minutes for the creepy box. One hour for the horror. Hour and 30 for the monster reward. Uh, use drops. Blah, 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 blah. So when you do them, then you claim them. You know what? Oh, I don't think I ever got my boxes. Actually, the first time I did it, I completed it and claimed it, but I never got them. Now that I think about that, that was jacked up. I was not happy about that. I was not happy about that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It may be only Steam. If you're on console, I don't think you can do it. I think you got to be on Steam, actually. Yeah, that's a good point, guys. So, yeah, if you're not PC, I don't think you can do it. If you're not Steam. Uh, a certain area to get what? Uh, to get what, Summer? I think it's just supposed to like be in the game, like you load in or whatever, and your drops that you earn supposed to be there, but um, but they never showed up. I never got my drops, and I like restarted the game. I you know, keep kept checking Twitch. It never showed up. Ah oh, man, I'm gonna lose lure now. Okay, I gotta get these rides out. All right, we got it. We got it. Let me get these rides out of here because I don't want to waste no more of this bait. I'm sure we're gonna have to use it again. Maybe not. Once we get the book, we you may not have to get the book again. I know you have to keep putting ingredients in to catch that Frankenfish. I might let that one go. Ah, we done hooked something. Dog on it. Get off the line. Get off the line. I'm going to let that one go. Hopefully, it'll let me keep this, uh, this bait. I did not want to waste that bait. Let's see, large cut, large minnows. Let me put a hook over here. I'm going to go over here and catch a couple gar. Yeah, I'll leave that. I was catching them joints with a 10 out too. Large minnows. Okay. Uh, let's see. Sometimes that stuff is put somewhere you wouldn't have thought of. Okay, yeah, I might have to go look in the menu or something and see if it's somewhere else. But we gonna catch us a couple guard real quick, guy. I'm gonna set up again just to try to get a little bit of this money back I done spent. Going around to these different lakes just to get this item. I would have had a million. I'd have spent 80K. Goodness. Well, 50, because 30 was repairing my equipment. So this is really 50, but still. That's too much. Too much. I serve too many people too much. Uh, <laughs> too much. I serve too many people. And when I'm finished serving, there won't be no sequel. I thought I took these crab out of my inventory. Oh, I had one still on the hook. Okay. And it got me over my little max limit, but whatever. All right. Look like we good. Let me see if we are in the peak real quick. We still slightly in the peak. So I'm going to throw these out, guys. We're going to catch us a couple gar. And, um, yeah, look like we got everything we're going to be able to get for today. 
other than if I either spend the bait coins or go to more lakes and spend more money. It doesn't look like I'm going to have the dried locust, nor will I have the, the noose. So I'm going to have to find those. It might not be till tomorrow, guys. We'll see. But yeah, man, y'all let me know if y'all doing this Halloween event. Have you spent bait coins to go ahead and get those items? Or are you still just going around trying to find the items yourself? This is my first year really doing this. I didn't do it last year. I've really been trying to do more of the promos, the tournaments, uh, now that I've leveled up a lot more. And now that I can actually um, handle, you know, lots of different types of fish, I can almost catch. or I can pretty much catch any type of fish at this point. I have the right setups, and it really grind it up, you know, with my level. So, yeah, let me know what y'all are doing in regards to this promo. Are you going to skip it? Are you participating? Y'all let me know. Let's see. PlayStation has a bit of stuff for Red Dead 2. Okay. For PlayStation members, uh, the other couldn't. Okay. Yeah, again, it kind of stinks that they don't have it tied in. It is mainly just Steam. It's kind of jacked up, but hopefully they'll they'll do something. Maybe they'll have some other type of uh, promotional or some type of thing that links in a similar fashion. But yeah, that does stink. Uh, we got us a Gar. Come on, Gar. These two rides I got right here are like 59 pounds. I know I had like 50 pounders. And I upgraded. So this actually gonna help me get this one in a little bit faster than the than the 40. I think I had like a 45 or 49 and a uh 50 and a 52. Now this 59 add a little bit more weight. Now this one right here with the yellow, this is still like a 50. So this one going, if it's a 60 pounder, 50 pounder, it's going to take a minute to get it in. If they get trophy status. But the other two, I mean, they still going to fight if they the big, big joints. But at least um, it'll come in a little quicker. Come on in, come on in. Let's see if I can set the hook. See if this one will get it in a little faster again. This is the heavier one. He He's swimming like he, he big, though. Yeah, I lost the other one. I don't care. I wanted this one. I don't care. Oh, yeah. I'll say that uh, now I haven't seen the interface on the PlayStation or Xbox, but even if assuming it's the same, using a controller is a lot more difficult when you're trying to navigate through the menus than uh, on the PC having the keyboard and mouse because you can just click the mouse on what you want when you need to. With this controller, you have to use the analogs. You have to use the bumpers. So sometimes, you know, your mind is like left and right, and you need to use this this for one thing, that for one thing, the, the D-pad for one thing. It get real confusing. And I, I use a controller, you know, on PC. But I can use the keyboard, you know, when I feel like it. But when I just try to use strictly the controller, yeah, it, it's very... Uh, it can be confusing a bit. Let's see. You would give the noose and the locusts if you could. You won't need them. Oh, man. Yeah, and it's jacked up because, again, it's random what you get out of those pumpkins. So you never really know, you know, exactly what you're going to get. So um, I appreciate that. Hey. I give I could a lot of this bait and lure, you know, these rides. It'd be great if you could share them, you know, with people. 
give them to people or even had like a used, even if they had a used store, a used market or something. But again, I know they, they're trying to ensure that they get their money, you know, as much as possible. But man, that would, that would make or create such a cool community. Uh, we already have a community, but that would grow and kind of build the community even further. If people could do that and interact with each other in that manner, man, you could really help each other even even further. But they don't allow it right now, so it is what it is. Oh, I know somebody was asking about my thumbnails. If you want to know how I do it, like I can show you. I start to do some tutorials because I do a lot of tutorials. Um, but I mean, it's easy way. They got plenty of little thumbnail builders and stuff like that, but I still, I'm old school. So I still make mine myself in Photoshop. Ah, got us a nice trophy. 94 pounds. That's pretty big. That's pretty big. Let me see how they look holding them. Ah, look at that. That's pretty cool. Got the pumpkin in the back. Hey, pumpkin in the back. Sun rooftop, digging in the scene with the gangster lane. Ah, all right, let me keep him. All right, guys, so yeah, we look like we've done about everything we can do for today, you know, other than doing some gar fishing. I might sit here and fish a little bit uh, before I shut it all, all the way down. But yeah, it's been pretty cool. First leg of the uh, the Halloween promo. And in fact, let's look at what we were able to accomplish real quick. So we did do the scary kayaking. We did the one at Emerald. We were able to get what we needed. And now we are on part two. But we need that noose. We got the two candle ends, but we need a noose. Then we can do this next one as far as the kayaking. And once we get done with that, it's going to send us to another lake. I think San Joe. And then the other part is getting this book. And we did that. We got to catch uh, these catfish using a dried locust. So hopefully we'll find some dried locust tomorrow or somewhere at another lake. I didn't really explore uh, blue crab. I was out there. I, I didn't know what I was looking for because it does have the pumpkin icon on the map. So I'll probably go back there and grind some more. I'll see what's out there as well. Maybe it'll be the locust. And then there's supposed to be some more missions that open up once you do the kayaking. So we'll see those. So again, in the next stream, we'll continue doing this. I do what I can off stream to get the uh, items that are needed in between. But beyond that, we'll do the rest together, guys. All right. Let's see. You caught a 22-pound flathead on your bobber setup today, trying to catch along those gar and the heron. It was tough. It's on Discord on the pics. All right. I'll check it out. I'll check it out. But I see you catching them biggest, man, working your way up. That's what's up. So, yeah, guys, hit that like button for me before you get out of here. Like, subscribe, share, do all that good stuff. Uh, follow. And, uh, yeah, really, really appreciate y'all rocking with me. Again, first leg of this Halloween series, Halloween promo. And uh, we're going to work our way to catching that Frankenfish, catching multiple Frankenfish uh, as we really learn this process and get it down, guys. All right. So, again, I hope everybody has a great day tomorrow. Start to that weekend. Enjoy your Friday. You know, peace, blessings. Hope your families are well and healthy. Uh, wish y'all a productive and prosperous day, man. And, and again, really, really appreciate everybody being here and rocking with me, guys. All right. So I will see y'all on the next one. Hit y'all on the later on. Have a very good night and have a great tomorrow. All right. Charles Macro Fishing Planet, salute to the elite. Thank you to my members. Thank you to my Patreons. Thank you to my Super Chatters. And again, thank you to everyone who comes here and supports and rocks with me during the stream and supports the channel, guy. All right? So I will see y'all later. Y'all have a good one. Y'all take it easy, and we'll be back in the next one.